Permafrost is terrain that has been frozen for at least two years and consists of soil, rocks and sediments amalgamated into a hole by ice. Most of today's permafrost was formed during and since the ice age and, due to its age, it has been accumulating large amounts of methane and carbon. Specifically, most of the Earth's permafrost is found in the Northern Hemisphere, Siberia, Tibet, Greenland, Alaska, etc. Reasons for permafrost melting the main culprit is the rise in the Earth's average temperature. According to the study, a global temperature increase of 1 C above pre-industrial levels will result in a loss of permafrost slightly larger than the size of India. While a 2 C increase would result in the loss of 40% of the world's permafrost. Consequences of melting permafrost, release of greenhouse gases. As mentioned above, the permafrost holds gigatons of methane and carbon dioxide in the subsoil. Their gradual release would lead to an acceleration of global warming which in turn would accelerate the melting of the remaining permafrost. Release of viruses and bacteria. In August 2016, in the Siberian tundra, a 12-year-old boy died, and dozens of people were hospitalized due to an outbreak of anthrax released by the thawing of a layer of permafrost. Scientists have found microbes that are over 400,000 years old in permafrost, so many of the viruses such as bubonic plague and smallpox are believed to lie dormant. Damage to ecosystems and their biodiversity. Melting Siberian permafrost is turning parts of the tundra into muddy landscapes, causing the local flora to disappear and the wildlife that feeds on it to starve. Furthermore, when the permafrost beneath water bodies, such as lakes, melts, the water seeps into the ground and disappears, causing droughts, landslides and geological accidents. As the ice that acts as cement binding the permafrost materials together melts, landslides can occur in cities built on the permafrost.